hello everyone my name is Muhammad Rifki welcome back to my second video I'm sorry my nose a bit runny here a little bit of cold but I hope my speech delivery is gonna be is going to be pretty good I wish that's what I hope uh, the, it's my second video for now I don't expect that the gap between my first video to my second video to be that close I thought I'm gonna work all, all of my three videos in span of six months but instead it's probably in three weeks mm -hmm. and my second video do that is tomorrow so I always work my video uh, before the due date uh, and my third video probably going to be released next week so just as recently that I want to cook at my course room because there are quite few reasons why I want to cook at my course room instead buy it outside like here for example so as you can see here the distance between my course room to Gerlong is quite far if you don't know Gerlong is it's just below UP and there's a lot of restaurant there, a lot of stationery and a lot of classroom and unfortunately as of today I don't have don't have a bike so the walking distance is around 900 meter or about 12 minutes of walk it's quite of time consuming I guess yeah, time consuming because just going there it takes about 12 minutes and then going back another 12 minutes and that's before I wait for my food and for now we just need to buy any stuff right like for example gas stuff easy right and well the problem is gas stuff create fire and any sand housekeeper doesn't want their resident to make fire inside their classroom because there's a lot of risks that have a bad outcome so yeah guest stuff is out of the option for the second option there's electric stuff even though it seems at the first glance electric stuff is a great alternative to guest stuff but the more i read about electric stuff the weakness became more apparent like for example Mespion brand electric stuff took about 10 minutes just to boil 600 milliliter of water. Although it may seem to you there's no other option other than gas or electric stuff, luckily for me there's a third option induction. What is induction cooking? Induction cooktops heat pots and pans directly instead of using an electric or gas heated element. The surface stays relatively cool, so spills, splatters, and occasional boilovers don't burn onto the cooktop, making cleanup quick and easy. How does it work? Usually, when you use a gas stove, the way they transfer the heat, usually by the fire itself, so it can be quite dangerous and hot. Alternatively, induction cooking heat pots and pans directly by using electric currents directly through magnetic induction. So, what's the benefit of using induction stove? Well, the first one is easy to set up. Just put the plug into the power socket, then start. Click the power button. The second one, it's easy to clean because the surface is smooth unlike gas stove. The third one, it's 100% safe. In other spectrum, what's not so good with induction stove? First thing first, I recently said that how induction stove transfer heat by utilize magnet induction. Well, most of cookware has a conductor element, but only few has ferromagnetic element. For example, you can use aluminum. The second reason why it's not so good, it produces quite a loud noise. 
and it's also hard to find. Like my indexing stuff and my induction pen came from Tokopedia. I recently went to Burma to find a smaller induction pen, but unfortunately, I can't find it. At the end of it, based on my experience, even though I just bought and have this stuff for about two weeks, and most of the time I only cook eggs and spam, I think it's pretty good. It heats up my pen instantly, and also you can custom your wood by your need. And if you want to cook egg or spam, it only needs about 200 watts. My conclusion is, if you want to cook in your course by induction, it's the most effective way and the most safe way by not creating fire and not burn your house down. So that's the end of the video. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed more than the last video. So for my next video, I think I'm gonna post it next week from now. Okay. Bye bye.